<laughs> Mr Chair? I call the Honourable Member Raymond Ho. Thank Nihau. you, Mr Chair. Ni Hao. Uh, thank... There you got it, I'm scared. <laughs> Big thank you to the Minister for that valuable contribution, for the excellent contribution. My, uh, my colleagues, uh, Chris Hipkins and Trevor Marlett and uh, Chris uh, and Charles Javal spoke earlier uh, in a detailed way as to why Labour believes it's very important for us to have a select committee. Because without uh, which, lots of the important things cannot be uh, addressed. Not, lots of uh, important issues cannot be addressed. So it's not only about the process, it's about the essence of the bill as well. For instance, um, as I said uh, at the first reading in my speech, there is a, an increasing demand for statistical, statistical information from EWI as more treaty settlements uh, are agreed. Statistics New Zealand, as I understand, uh, is working with EWI to identify uh, what type of statistics will be most useful uh, for collective management of transferred assets. So I have two questions. Given we are um, uh, ramming through the, uh, the bill uh, and the urgency, there is no such kind of avenue for us to debate this issue at uh, select committee. Uh, I would be very grateful for the Minister to uh, enlighten us. So the first question is, I'm wondering whether the Minister has ever considered a... Uh, whether the issue could be addressed in, uh, in consideration of the 2013 uh, census, and B, uh, what type of statistics uh, would best serve Māori to support the management of assets obtained from treaty settlements? So this is, uh, these are my two questions, and I would be, I would be very grateful if, uh, if the, the minister could enlighten us. Mr. Chairman. Um, I call 